A vessel is a container. It is not used to do something but to contain something. We are all destined to contain God. We were all made to be containers of the Creator. Are you a vessel? I'm coming, I'm coming to, get, to get, you. get you, she screamed on the other end of the phone. He allowed her to speak. I was sitting at work and I just got this feeling that I should call you and check on you. Now, she didn't have any clue that he would be at home at this time. She didn't exactly know his schedule or his whereabouts. She didn't even know his address. But this feeling, a feeling that she never felt before, came over her and she was forced to act upon it. Instead of holding on to a petty grudge, he listened to his sister. He low-key was grateful that she called. Ironically, she would be a vessel in his rebirth. The creator has sent his own flesh and blood to save him. She would be used as one of his many messengers. She jumped in the cab and headed in his direction. She was determined to be a container of the creator. There she stood at the front of his apartment door. Oh, so quick and so fast, she arrived like a strike of lightning. This was meant to be. The creator had sent her to deliver a message. The message was encrypted and he would have to decode it on his own. She made him pack up a few things and they headed off to her house. Message! You just learning in a good environment and everybody's helping each other out and everybody gets a chance to succeed. When he arrived at his sister's home, he was shocked to see his brother was there, but yet he was overjoyed as well. He immediately felt reconnected. His brother had endured the same trials and tribulations he did when they were growing up. His brother made him feel comfortable and wanted. It was as if his brother already won the battle he was currently fighting. They slept in the same bed and watched any and every movie his brother suggested he watch. This is when he learned how to roll with Bamboo and Fonto, which was way better than those harsh Blountvilles he was introduced to when he first started smoking weed a few years ago. They smoked back to back and stayed high as fuck. They were always laughing about stupidity. He thrived off his brother's energy at that moment. His brother was another vessel in his rebirth. Listen, when you're at war, the simple things will shelter you. To rekindle with your blood can revive you. It can spark a flame in your soul that you may have never felt before. Your past that you are afraid of can be a vessel if you just allow it to be.